um, it has been a while since we've talked together. Uh, it is 9 a.m. Uh, it is a game day for me, so um, I thought I'd take you guys through what I eat on days that I have games in order for me to still hit my macros. Um, so each morning, it's a little bit easier on me when we have home games instead of away games. Away games is very difficult, but on a home game, um, I'll start off with well, what I have right here. Let's see if I can lift this up and show you. We've got six ounces of lean ground beef and then six servings of egg substitute. So we're going to start the morning off with that and I'll just take you through today of what I eat and such. So I will see you then. Okay guys, we are on our way to the hitting facility to get a little batting practice in before the game. Um, I'm on my way to the gas station before I go there to get a few things. I'll show you what I get there. It's kind of like a, a couple things that I'll eat before the game. And then I also brought a few things um, to eat possibly during the game, in between games, after the game, if I get hungry. Um, it's a couple of things that I may eat, I may not eat, but um, a big part of this type of dieting or lifestyle that you want to call it is being prepared and it, tracking your macros gives you a way to um, stay on track but also have a life while doing it so that's why it works really well for myself and Austin as well so I will show you what I get at this gas station here in a little bit okay so here is what I got well a few things I got at the gas station were the Rockstar and the trolley octopus that I've already tacked into um, so both of those well I've had a serving of these before I go into batting practice I'll have another serving in between the um, games probably or maybe even before the first game um, these the cliff bars the quest bars the red velvet pop tarts those will all be taken probably like during the game maybe in between the two games they feed us but on a side note uh, I'm not sure how many of you follow me on Instagram, but I have decided to compete in a show in Fort Wayne, Indiana. The I can't remember the exact name right now, but I am like 16 weeks out. Um, I haven't been sending much video to Austin because I'm lazy, I guess. Uh, so the best way to keep up with me for that prep as of now until the school year's over is probably to follow me on Instagram. So my Instagram stuff is somewhere in the, the box or something. Yeah, still waiting on everybody. No one's here. I think I'm an hour early or something like that. See ya. On a side note, I'm pointing again. What's up guys? Um, games are over. I ate all of that food that I brought with me, the Quest Bars and the Pop-Tarts and the Cliff Bars. Um, the parents supplied food, but it was hot dogs, and I wasn't really feeling hot dogs in between games anyway. So, And they also had bananas and those cutie clementines, so I had some of those. Um, but besides that, I just finished, my shoulder's getting so tired. My, I finished what I had brought, and now I'm, I'm on track still. I was at, after all the food that I ate while I was there, I'm at like 70% of everything. So now I'm going to have um, six ounces of, of chicken with rib meat. I'm not sure how this is gonna taste. I think I grabbed the wrong thing, but we're gonna give this a run. And then if any of you watch the online coach, he is a big fan of the um, vegetable medley, the Green Giant brand. And I like it as well. So I'm gonna have that whole bag. Um, and then I've got a little bit left over. I'm going to have some dessert. So I will be showing you guys that here in a second. Okay, so I just finished dinner. I am going to have two servings of red velvet Oreos, so four total cookies, and then 
the skinny cow ice cream sandwich and that is going to finish off my macros. Um, we'll put the uh, total macros that I had today in at the end of the video. So I hope that you guys enjoyed um, kind of seeing how I stay on track on days that I am my most busy, I guess. Um, it would be it, it'd be more um, interesting probably to see how I stay on track for road trips and I can do a video. If you guys would like that, um, just comment below and let us know. Um, I hope this helps any athletes that we have watching the channel that are trying to stay on track while playing their sport. So um, again, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Campus physique, we're out. It's a revolution.